Hey there, and welcome back to Racknerd. I'm Christian, and I'm here to share some exciting news with you. We've recently launched a new feature that will allow you to change your VPS primary IPv4 address via our self-server client portal. This means that you no longer need to contact our support team to get this done. So you can do it yourself quickly and easily. So whether you're an existing customer of Racknerd or a potential one, this is good news for you. So let's get into it. Okay, so before we get into the nitty gritty of how to use this feature, let me go over a few important details. Firstly, our VPS IP replacement policy remains unchanged. If you request the IP change within the first 72 hours, we offer it completely free. However, if you request it after the first 72 hours, or if you've already used your free IP change, it will cost $3 per change. Secondly, please note that this feature is to automatically replace your main VPS IP with a new one. If you want to order additional IPs, please contact our sales department. Now, let me go ahead and share my screen here and let's get started with the process of changing your VPS primary IPv4 address. To get started, log into the Racknerd client area. We'll have a link in the description down below you can take to go directly to that login page. Next, click on the services section as you can see here. You will now be directed to the services list page where you can click on the VPS you wish to change the VPS IP on. Click on it and allow several seconds for the page to fully load. After selecting the VPS, click on change IP. This will be located under the action section on the left-hand side. After clicking the change IP button, you will be redirected to a prompt that reminds you of our IPv4 replacement policy. From here, you can either go back or proceed. If you want to change your IP address, then press the green proceed button. After pressing the proceed button, if you are resetting your first IP change within the first 72 hours, the VPS IP will be replaced automatically and a support ticket will be created under your account with the new VPS IP details within a few minutes. But please keep in mind if you requested this after that 72 hour period, or if you already utilized your free IP change within the first 72 hours, you will be redirected to the invoice to pay for your request. In my case, since my VPS has already been set up over 72 hours ago, there will be a fee for this IP change request. And from the invoice page, you are free to choose any payment method from the several options that we have available for you. In my case, I will just pay it with my available credit for the sake of this tutorial. Once the invoice is paid, then IP change request will be processed automatically within a few minutes when the payment has been completed and the support ticket will be created under your account with the new VPS IP details. So let's check back to the client area to continue on with the process. Also, please keep in mind during the IP change process, it is normal for the page to take about a minute to load. So don't worry, please give it a few moments to do its job. Next, once the IP change process is complete, head over to the support ticket page. Click on the new ticket that was just created and you should be able to view your new IPv4 address details from here. You will also receive an email with this information also. And there you have it. It really is that easy to change your VPS primary IPv4 address with Racknerd. Just remember to meet the requirements that I mentioned earlier, which include having no support tickets regarding the VPS service in question and having no unresolved abuse cases on your account. You can also check out our written tutorial about this in the video description below if you prefer reading instead. So thank you for watching. And if you found this video helpful, please give us a like and visit us at rackner.com to learn more about our VPS hosting services, or you can click this next video on screen to learn more. Take care.